Hey everyone, welcome back yet again. I know I've been gone for quite a while, but I just have not had time to make a video. But Vice has finally come through after months, and this is officially my second to last box. I have one more box coming from them, and honestly, I had very low expectations for this box because I've seen them post a few things on Instagram, and what I saw was a champagne bottle and two fancy glasses. That was it, and I thought that was the box I was getting. I was going to be very disappointed if that was it. So this would be my October box. Next one I should be getting is in November and I'm really, really hoping it's the uh, Avid calendar they do every year, but we'll see. But this one I have peeked into it. It is very fun, so stay tuned and let's see what we got. I will be doing the whole thing and doing a proper review of this one and hopefully not messing this one up like I did the last one ended so I don't have to do another video so soon. Okay, so back to it. So, right off the bat, here's this. You guys want to use this code. It's for sparkling cider, sparkling champagne. 20% uh, off a three-pack or six-pack. Check it out, guys. Go check them out. I haven't tried it yet, so I couldn't speak for them. Go through the booklet really quick, guys. With most men, life is like backgammon. Half skill and half luck. I'm not going to deny that. <laughs> Oliver Wilde who said that. And I'm going to start posting these quotes on Twitter, I think. First one, um, like I said, I've already peeked into it. haven't opened anything that has seals on it, but this one didn't have a seal, and I did open it. And it is a portable backgammon board. It is awesome. Uh, colors, meh, hit and miss, but I get the theme on it. Yeah, and I thought it was like uh, rolled up uh, utensils and whatnot. I thought it was going to be a picnic uh, basket kind of situation. A little bit of that backgammon. This is the third game I've gotten from Vice in the past two years. I got Jenga, uh, Mahjong, and now this backgammon. <clears throat> I haven't taken the set out or anything. Um, but let's see. The finest sparkling uh, wine that makes its finest spritz. So it's sparkling wine, guys. Wasn't sure, but these are sparkling wines. So if you guys are into it, use the code and... Feel free to try them. If you have tried them, let me know what you think. And then we get some vermouth um, mixer. I've never been much of a vermouth guy, but it's from, it's there. I saw the bottle. Looks really nice. I have to find a way to use it at some point. There is saffron vermouth, fancy. And yes, I saw that in there, and I was really looking forward to trying these. Uh, wine gummies. You can't have a glass of can't have a glass and have a gummy. So I'm gonna try to get drunk off gummies. It's gonna be a good time. And that's it, as far as I can tell. Let's get right into it, guys, or get back into it, I should say. No, that was really it. Um, I thought there was more for some reason. Move this down a bit, guys, so you guys can see everything with me. There we go. So here's the vermouth bottle. Looks super fancy, and I'm not big on making mixed drinks. Uh, I might have my friends uh, in my throw party and have them tell me how to use this, because I don't think you're supposed to drink this straight. I think it's supposed to be for mixing. It is 17% alcohol, and the bottle does look amazing. So that's fun. It's going to be a very short video now that I'm thinking about it. And here's that sparkling wine. Um, but, yeah... I might save this for New Year's and just pop it. There we go. Yeah. And here's the cool, the cool little toys about this. Uh, the backgammon board. Like I said, I already ripped this one open because I was like, oh, cool. And it is. If this is good for travels or anything along those lines. I said everything's still in there. I, like I said, I don't know how to play this game officially. Here it doesn't take very long to learn, but it's all there. It's all included. Some dice, which I have plenty of, but some more dice never hurt anyone. And it made it very convenient to roll up and take it along with you. I'm assuming you're supposed to take like, backgammon while you sip on a cup of wine or something. And that's that. I said, super short video. I think the longest part about this is going to be actually looking these up. Still got those there, so oh, I could do it with an L. That works. Gummies, wine gummies. This is awesome. 
Sparkling rose gum is an out as a standout with all the notes you expect. Delicious whiffs of charming raspberry aroma via aroma via the white flower. I can't say all these words, guys. So yeah, check it out, guys. A wine gummies wine design. Let me look at these and see what else they can offer. But let's get right into it and price this box out. I always hold these about a hundred dollars because I paid for it about uh, for it up front, so twelve hundred ish dollars. So we'll go one oh five a box. We're gonna start right here. A vermouth. I don't know what these are supposed to be. You're supposed to use to make these, other than martinis, if I'm not mistaken. Mm, can I spell today? There we go. Let's see if we can get this to focus a bit more. Well, that was very fast. Wow, I cannot get this to focus. There we go. I had to zoom in a bit. $23, give or take. Let's go to the actual website. Yes, enter the site. Let's see, where are your products, guys? No products. Let's go to the right bottom one. Wait. <clears throat> Oh, on Instagram, start your journey. Doesn't give me a price on here. I think they just made this website to promote it. I'll go to this. Wine search, where's that? Uptown, Uptown. Oof. I don't think that's right, because I literally saw one up here for $23. <laughs> yes. Vermouth, twenty three dollars is seven fifty. Seven hundred fifty milliliter or no? So I found one for twenty three dollars, and I find other ones for around forty dollars. Where's that forty? Why is this? Oh, delivery sixty three. Okay, so with shipping and everything, yeah, it gets expensive very fast. Let's go shopping. There we go. So I'm going to say about $41. I find it there, but then they add shipping and it jumps to $60. i am going to say $45 just to make it an even amount. And I do have my fancy pen somewhere around here. There it is. Or what I would consider to be a fancy pen. And that's just random piece of paper I had. So we're going to go $45. All right, we're one third of the way there already, guys. Okay, got the vermouth out of the way. Let's see what that is. F I O L Pro Go. Oh, that's probably why. There we go. That's it right there, but let's see. Shopping. Let's go to all, because I think this should have a website. There it is. Mm, can you not? Come on. There we go. Yes. Accept all the cookies, whatever. Buy. Or an author website directly. There it is. I got this one, so we're going to go ahead and buy it. Guess we have to do it this way. Yes, come on. Just let me see the price is 16 20 dollars Three packs, so... Here we go, guys. So we can do that. So what is that? A three pack is fifty-five dollars. Let's do some math for you guys. Fifty-five times point two, uh, eleven dollars off comes out to be about forty-four dollars for a three pack, or one oh eight. Let's see. One oh eight times point two, twenty-one off. 
is $21. About $87 for a six pack, guys, if you guys want to use the code. But we only got one, so I'm going to round that up to 19. I'm not going to do 20, I'll do 19 here. All right, backgammon. Let's see if there's a. Let's see if the book has an actual creator of this. I don't think it does. <clears throat> Vice exclusive right there. So best case scenario, we're gonna be able to find it online somewhere. Um, back, gammon, Vice. So vice exclusive usually means they had it made means they had it made it specifically for this box and there's no creator uh, behind it. Mm -hmm. Shopping. That's not going to be the price for it. Backgammon. Not portable. It's not going to be that. We're going to go use that price because it's a just different color and it's at Walmart. We'll bump it up to. I'll leave it at thirty, guys. I can't justify spending any more than thirty on that. Pink is the only thing. We'll, I'll be nice and say it's forty. All right, and the last thing is these uh, sparkling rose. So I'm actually, these are the ones I'm most curious about. The real, oh, let's delete all that. The real wine gum. There they are. Um, let's see. Let's not do shopping. Let's do that one. Is that it or is that one? the real wine gum? There we go. Awesome. No, we're just going to go view shop. I don't want to do all that stuff. View shop. So we got, which one did we get? It's not on there. It's that one. It's eight, eight euros. Let me do some conversion guys. And I'll let you know. Eight euros. Euro to dollar. Euro to dollar. Let's see. Eight. It's eight bucks, guys. It's about seven eighty-four. So I do eight bucks on that. Where's my pen? There's my pen. So eight bucks. And let's go here. We're gonna do forty-five plus nineteen plus forty, being generous there. Plus eight. So it's about to be one twelve. So. Once again, this box has paid itself off. And that was me being generous on here. Um, an extra $10, 102. I can probably find this on eBay and so I was probably gonna try to charge much more than that. So I still think it's about 112, give or take. But we will see what happens with that, guys. But that's it for this one, guys. There's one more Rob Vice video coming up. And when it's going to be put out, I couldn't tell you because, like I said, their shipping is not doing too great right now. So all I can do is play a waiting game, but there is one more Bob coming. Like I said, I'm really hoping it is the Avid calendar so I can do all of uh, December, just one video every day, every day till Christmas for December. But if it's not, something November or something fall more than likely. I don't remember what I got last time, but I look forward to it. Two new bottles out to the collection, fun new game. And these are going to be amazing, I hope. But if not, I will let you guys know on the next video how these turned out. But that's it for this one, guys. As always, thank you very much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and all that good jazz. And yeah, this is second to last Rob Vice video. Like I said, I will be trying to put out other content. But as I'll, Again, once again, guys, thanks for watching. See ya.